Welcome back guys. Today I'll show you some of the benefits of using a front roller and I'll show you just how easy it is to install one. If you have a residential reel, like a True Cut, a McLean, or even a Cali trimmer, a lot of them come stock with the front caster wheels. Those wheels are a horrible design and they can cause scalping in your yard because they're going to dip and dive into every hole and low spot you have. A much better option is to get a roller. I decided to go with this groove roller, not just because it looks badass, but with the groove roller, it actually helps the turf stand up in the front to give you a better quality of cut. A better quality of cut can equal less stress on the turf, which can equal total domination. So for the tools needed, I'm just using a standard drill with a half inch socket and two wrenches, a half inch and a 7 16 Now this all aluminum construction, slim fold platform with dual locking legs and a 300 pound weight capacity from Gorilla Ladders is completely optional although I'd highly recommend one. So to take off these caster wheels, you just have two bolts on each side. So I'm gonna loosen up these top ones first. So I will need my 7 16 wrench. Grab that one here, just loosen this one up. There are washers right here, and there's also this spacer right in there, so just be sure you keep all your existing hardware because we will reuse these. Here's a better look at that spacer. So you wanna get that bad boy out of there. Don't lose it, cause you will need it. And for the bottom side, we're gonna do the same thing for this one. I'm gonna have a, use a half inch wrench and uh, take this one off as well. There we go. And then we'll just repeat for the other side. Now probably the most important thing to look at when you're taking this off is the holes you have four holes in the bracket here one two three four you're going to go in the same position of these holes so in this case mine were in the first and then the third so that's where i'm going to mount the new roller at so now that we have all the bolts loosened this is probably the most important step we need to find a nice and safe spot let's loosen these up so So now we're ready to install the new grooved roller. So now I'm all aligned just like I was on the old one. I've got the first hole aligned with the first notch here and I've got the third one here and the third one. So I'm ready to mount the hardware using the existing hardware. roller installed I'm definitely ready for the season and I can't wait to see how it performs if you guys want to learn more about these rollers be sure to head over to real rollers I'll put a link down in the description below don't forget to follow me on the gram you can find me at Bermuda underscore boss show me some love and I'll see you in the next one what are you doing out there come in here